experimenting with new makeup, peel and reveal lip color. Wonder blading with Wonder Skin. Hello, beautiful people. This is Anne, Fabulous Life 101. Thanks for tuning in today on my channel. We'll cover makeup, skin care, fashion, travel, anything that makes you feel more fabulous at any age. Well, today I'm experimenting with this Wonder Skin Wonder Blading Lip Color. It's a lip mask. You put it on, leave it on for a few seconds, peel it off, and it's supposed to leave your lips with color all day. Does it work? Is it enough? I'll let you know. Okay, today I am trying out Wonder Skin Wonder Blading Lip Color. It is called Liquid Blading Technology Peel and Reveal for Perfect All Day Lip Color. And this is sort of a multi-step process. So the first thing I'm gonna do is I'm gonna use this lip scrub. And it has sort of a mint taste to it. And, and just tissue it off so my lips are nice and clean. It comes in multiple colors. The color I'm testing is called Lovely. And this is what it is. The Lovely is supposed to be kind of a nude, but look, the pen is actually purple. It says apply two to three coats of the lip mask onto clean exfoliated lips like a lip gloss. Leave it on for 10 to 45 seconds. The longer you leave it on, the more saturated the lip color will be. Okay. Because this is a stain, it's important to get it on evenly. I guess that's one coat. That's two coats. All right. All right, three coats. I'm gonna start by doing about 20 seconds and then decide whether to leave it on less or more in the future. So, looking at my watch, this is about 10 seconds, 15, and it's almost at 20. Then you're supposed to spray with this activator. It doesn't taste very good. So this is supposed to transform it to a peel off film. Okay, let's see if that works. I've never been good at peeling stuff off. There we go. This did not really leave that much color. Oh, still have some purple on there. I think maybe I'll leave it on a little bit longer the next time. It does give it sort of a stain, a nude stain. It still kind of has sort of a no makeup look. I kind of want a little more shine, so I think I'm gonna find something to top it with. Let's see. I think I'm gonna, actually I'm gonna to top it with this lip injection lip gloss from Too Faced, which is sort of a plumper as well. So let's see how it looks when you top it with this. I like that a little bit better. It may be just be that the color I got was so close to my natural lips, but I don't really notice a lot of difference after using this. I think I'm gonna try it tomorrow, leaving it on for a longer period of time. Okay, it's the next morning, and while that lip mask was not as deep a color as I expected, it lasted. It lasted through meals, really until I washed my lips and used a lip scrub to get it off. Then it came off very easily. Uh, it did not have any sticky effect or anything on my lips. It also did not do any of the other things like plumping or moisturizing that I often look for in a lipstick. However, I'm gonna try it today. I'm gonna leave it on for the full 40 seconds and see how that works. So here it is, the purple and
Okay, it's the mask is on. I'm going to count down 40 seconds. All right, so this is the spray that's best to allow you to peel it off. There we go. Still doesn't peel that smoothly. Okay, it has slightly more tint than before, but again, it's not enough for me. I don't just want a little bit of tint to my lips. I want them to look a little fuller, a little moister. So I'm going to go on and actually I'm going to use my Rinna Beauty today and just add a little bit of liner. Now I think maybe that this, you know, nude color is just not a lot of intensity. Uh, reds and the pinks I've heard are a little bit brighter, but this color I think works the best for me. It does give my lips some color. So if I go swimming, if I sweat a lot, or I eat a messy meal, there will still be some tint to my lips, but it doesn't have the plumpness, the moisture, the other things you really want. I'm going to just use this clear plumping moisturizer from Renner Beauty to cover it. But all you really need to do with this, to do that, is just add a little bit of gloss, maybe a little liner. So yeah, I like the way the lips look now, but it's not the be all end all. I have to use something else with it to really get the type lip look I want. So while this thing does work, it does stain your lips, you really need, if you want moist lips, if you want plump lips, you really need to use something else with it. It doesn't really do that alone. But overall, it is a kind of unique product, kind of fun. I don't think I'm going to be using it every day, but it's something nice to have. This is the Wonder Skin. Um, this is the box. You order it online. I'll put a link down below. Wonder Blading Lip Color. Well, that's the video for today. If you enjoyed it, could you please give it a thumbs up? Thanks for watching. Have a fabulous day. Peace, love, and light.